I, the Lord, have called thee in righteousness and will hold thine hand and will keep thee and give thee for a covenant the light of the Gentiles, right? And I had this experience when I was, I don't know, five or six maybe. And I was sitting in front of the black and white TV with bunny ears that I'm like dating myself just a little bit. Had little bunny ears. It did have the little UVF. I can't believe I actually remember that. The UVF antenna was the round where we got like the channel 56 instead of just two, four, and seven. Anyway, bunny ears, black and white TV. We would sit like two feet from the television, which I'm sure wasn't the best in the world. But I was sitting in this blue chair right in front of the TV, probably watching cartoons or something. I don't really remember. And I remember sitting there thinking about God. Yeah, I was pretty dorky at a young age thinking about God, but I was probably because of Sunday school. So thank you, Sunday school teachers. And I was wondering, is God here right now? Like, I remember this little, my little kid brain thinking, I wonder if God's here right now. Well, God's everywhere. I learned that in Sunday school. God is everywhere. God must be here. So it's like, God, are you here? And I felt, oh, I'm getting chills when I think this. I, I still feel it. I felt, I felt like an angel, I guess, hold my hand. I felt my hand being held. I was like, oh, okay, God, you're here. It's going to make me cry. Okay, God, you're here. And I just felt this presence of God. It was like, I just accepted it like it was no big deal. Like, that's normal. <laughs> yeah, that happens all the time. Just, you know, holding my hand. And then I went back to watching cartoons or whatever it was I was watching. But whenever I read that, I, the Lord, have called thee in righteousness and will hold thine hand. It's like God calls us in righteousness. God doesn't call us in temptation. God calls us in righteousness and holds our hand. So when we are being tempted, we can hold on to God's hand and know that God is calling us in righteousness. God is going to support us in seeing through the illusion of limitation to see reality, to see the limitless nature of who we are innocent and pure and whole with no limitation with no sense of regret or fear no sense of lack like all of those things that would try to plague us none of that where it's just simple and pure and whole innocent and there is that place inside of each one of us the kingdom of God is within you. And that's the place that, that Christian science gives us an understanding of. And that gives us freedom.